welcome to week 204 for January 2019 and watch me suck at bowling coming to you from the easiest candle pin house ever in history of candle pin bowling Masons and we're bowling on not so lucky 16 this lane is not treating me well if it weren't for a strike of all things everything would have been a total disaster let's show you the score what? You can see game one wasn't all that great. It wound up ending at a 79. Number two is pretty decent, right at average ability with a 92. And that strike in frame seven saved the day and we eked out the bottom end of the average ability scale with an 81. So now it's single games for the rest of January. Let's see how they go. Probably as bad as everything else did. Watch Me Suck at Bowling is proud to sponsor the hit Candlepin TV show, King of the Palace. Watch people that are good at this instead of me. Type in King of the Palace in the YouTube search bar and watch to your heart's content. And if you like what you see, go to youtube.com slash new palace lanes. Hit that bell, hit that subscribe button, and you'll see videos as they come along. And now, for the opposite of King of the Palace, the show you tuned into. Frame one, ball one. Balling, right? Why you Come on. Ball two. Yeah, ready, I do. 18. We're on 18. One person on the floor at a time. Uh, I got a few trading Actually, no, it's fine. It just gets Ball three. Hey. This be the worst stink frame. Hey. I see the future and it looks ugly. First frame is a five, and for those of you who like the pin setters, here's the bull more in action. And there you go. Frame two, ball one. Seven. So far, what a terrible start. We got an awful five and one, and a seven and two, which isn't very good with an awful start. Very weak 12 to begin with. Let's see if things get better. Frame three, ball one. So far, this is the worst in the series. I get screwed, that's a seven. Three, three, ball one. fell out. At least it's an eight. Still a weak performance. We got a seven and three and an eight and four. The only decent frame so far. Week 27. Will things improve? 
Hopefully they do. Frame four one one. That's a lot. Ball two. If all ten pins are up, foul balls will. Oh, you are allowed to reset. The other lob it was small enough. I let it live. Wishing that was ball two, but we'll take ten. Frame six, ball one. Ball two. Two tens in a row. That's a lot better. A pair of tens in five and six, we are at 47. Could this be the improvement that we've been looking for? For a meatball one. I'm gonna do that next round. Nope, it's seven. Ball two. Ball three. It's our friend Bob Kaleri. Best we can do is nine. And that would be a seven. Now it's frame eight, ball one. Ball two. Those two frames were a little weak. We got a seven and seven and an eight and eight. Eights are usually okay, but the way things are going, not so much. We are at 62. Chances of a good game are dying. Frame nine, ball one. I'll take this. You look good. Looks like a two cab. Yeah, you can't. Going all in. Going all in. Score! I smacked your button and said you got this. Ball two. You only want the ten. This time the king didn't survive for the spare. Last frame, ball one. El Stinko, the bonus ball. What will the bonus be? If it's good, it's gonna save it. Just behind the lob line. And crappy lead, but a seven fill ain't too bad. Ball two, good territory, but barely. I'm gonna do the thing I did before, it got me a little point. Ball three. And seven, but at least we're in average range. That spare definitely saved the game. It would have been mediocre if it didn't happen. So we got the spare in nine, and then just the seven and ten, which makes the fill for aforementioned spare in nine, brings us up to a halfway decent score of 86. 
There were a lot of weak frames, so the fact that we even got it that high with what we have, not too bad. That will conclude week two of five for the month of January 2019 in Watch Me Suck It Bowling. From Mason's Bowling Center in Lemonster, Massachusetts, this is George F551 saying hope you enjoyed and have a good one.